All right, in Oakland County, there are four days of tacos entertainment and maybe some cerveza and tequila starting at 11 o'clock this morning. Sounds like a good time. <laughs> it is time for the Royal Oak Taco Fest, and the food trucks are lined up and ready to go. So joining us live this morning, Tanya Vardy from Soaring Eagle Casino and Hassan Musulmani from Drunken Rooster. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Happy Good morning. 4th of July. All right. right. Happy 4th of July to you as well, Tanya. Uh, so, Tanya, you're with Soaring Eagle Casino, who uh, puts on this event. Uh, tell us a little bit what, yes. about what people can expect if they're headed there today. Well, the event today runs from 11 to 11, um, today, Friday and Saturday. And uh, we have over 50 eateries, taquerias, tacos, burritos, uh, 100 music bands playing on four different stages. Kids zone, so the kids can have some activities. Uh, for the adults, we got frozen margaritas. You can taste some uh, premium brand tequila. And uh, uh, did I mention the food? We have lots of food, and we're going to have beautiful weather. I'm, I brought the beautiful weather from Mount Pleasant. So Good work. It's all going to happen this weekend. Good work. Okay, so <laughs> can you take a taco down the bouncy, the, the, the big slide of the bouncy house? Oh, me, I would for sure, yes. I, they probably don't highly recommend it, but, but yeah, why not? Because I'm sure they got walking tacos somewhere around here. And Tanya, where exactly are all of these food trucks located in Royal Oak? So we are um, downtown in the uh, Commons area, and they're literally about probably four or five blocks where they've got the trucks, and then they're intermingled with the stages. Uh, and then the frozen margaritas you've got available too. Um, <laughs> She's so it's really margaritas. in a nice small area. <laughs> <laughs> you really, you're sweet. You're, you know who you're speaking to. Right? I love yeah. a margarita. You've Tanya. got four to five yeah. blocks I, I do. of tacos I got you, and girl. margaritas. I got you. <laughs> All right. So speaking of, you're standing next to Hassan there from the Drunken Rooster uh, food truck. There, Hassan, what are you whipping up early this morning? And can I have some? <laughs> Hey, good morning. Uh, we'll be sure to send some back to the station with you guys. <laughs> We're doing our uh, usual, we do tacos with a Mediterranean twist, so we use a lot of Middle Eastern seasonings. Uh, we do a green chili and beer braised chicken, a pork shawarma taco. Uh, we have our loaded fries here, which comes with chicken. And then we do our Metro Detroit famous street corn. Uh, we have the original flavor, the hot Cheetos, the Cheetos. And then every festival, I always make sure to roll out a mystery flavor for the street corn, just to kind of Keep it fun for people. They get to try it. Guess what it is. Oh, that one looks spicy. And yeah, I was going to say that I one looks like good. That one. Yeah, the hot good. Cheetos is absolutely delicious. It's not too spicy. Uh, you know, the mayonnaise on the corn really tones down the hot Cheetos, and uh, it's just absolutely uh, delicious. Uh, we sell probably close to 6,000 years of corn every time we do this festival. 6,000 uh, years of corn? That's amazing. Yeah, it's. I got. I have literally three pallets of corn that I buy. It's, <laughs> I'm gonna break an axle on a truck one day buying all this corn. <laughs> uh, what, what's the fan favorite? What do you sell out of the most? Uh, you know, the traditional is always the top seller, and then the hot Cheetos I would say is number two, and then the mystery flavor is number three. Uh, Cheetos is a great flavor. Unfortunately, it's never the top seller. And then on our truck. Uh, the pork shawarma taco is our flagship taco. I don't think I've seen anybody making pork shawarma anywhere. And then our loaded fries, it's just, it's like our kitchen sink. It's got all of our toppings, salsa, sour cream, pickled cabbage, cilantro, carrots. Wow. It's got our za'atar fries. We use uh, Middle Eastern Mediterranean seasonings with the fries as well. So it's got za'atar, sumac, chipotle, ancho, guajillo, salt, pepper, and uh, yeah, it's, you know, something a little different. It's not a traditional taco, but there's definitely enough traditional tacos here if you want that yeah, as well. Why, why go traditional when you can try something different? Now, I can tell you right now, the man behind the camera, Mike, he's ecstatic to try this <laughs> flaming Cheeto uh, oh, street yeah. corn, right? We, we right? He's going to take sure this whole table that. and throw it right in the back of the van. <laughs> <laughs> yes. uh, that, I love that, Mike. Um, works of art, those tacos, by Absolutely. the way. Absolutely. looks great. Amazing. I have to ask you, though, the, the Drunken Rooster much. name, where does this come from? Uh, you know, when I was a kid, my mom, she used to make that beer can chicken, so I kind of named it as an homage to my mom. Sounded pretty fun, and uh, yeah, we just stuck with it. And then also, when we cook the chicken, we pour some beer on there when we're cooking it on the grill with the seasonings and the salsa. So it's kind of similar to what my mom used to make, oh my although gosh. it's it. absolutely nothing similar. Between between your beer and Tanya's margaritas, we're going to have a good weekend here. A couple right? of drunken <laughs> roosters walking around. Yep, Royal AAA's going to take care of us. <laughs> uh, thank you guys so much for getting up early with us this morning and joining us. Thank and, you. Uh, you know, that pleasure. food looks delicious. We're, we're pretty jealous of our photographer, Mike, who's going to enjoy He's that. He's going to have a good time. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Tanya, Hassan, thank, thank you, you so very much, much for joining us. We appreciate it.
And by the way, we are going to check back in at Taco Fest coming up at 6.30 a.m. So stay tuned for that, guys. You can't go wrong with Taco Fest. No, and it's not just tacos, as you saw it's there. not just tacos. Yes. All right, so from tacos to another holiday favorite, you and your hot